Hey guys, welcome to the Reviews and Opinions, and today I'm talking about why these schools are getting shot up, why there are mass shootings happening in America. And the reason is, um, this is just a boil, just boil it down to its face value. It's people without morality, it's people who are taught that they had moral ethics are a thing of the past. It's people who are being taught that evolution says that you just by chance. And if you look at who the number one target is in these schools, especially at the high school level, most of the time, it's the Christians. Look at Columbine. The number one, the thing that those people were shooting Columbine for. The Christians, they were going for the Christians. They want to stop Christianity because they think Christianity is a bad religion. They think Christianity needs to be stomped out. And if you look at the latest high school shooting, if you boil it down to religious f deals, like what, it, like ever, like the main point of the kid, like the main section of the people that actually died, like especially the kids, you boil it down to what religious they, what religion they were. Christianity would be number one, and why they and and if you look at who the shooter was, it was probably someone who was bullied, and a Christian tried to help them, tried to show them Christianity, and they rejected it, and they says they were being pushy and stuff. I'm gonna go kill them now. I'm gonna kill off their whole religion because it stinks. Um, but that's not right. You shouldn't do that. Christianity. Is the really the only way to live? Um, I was raised in the Seventh Day Adventist home. Well, I still have a home, but I was not. I for a few years there, I loved the atheistic beliefs and stuff. And when I found out the truth between the Christ between Christianity and the atheism, I uh, I says no, atheism is all wrong. This like the evidence just hits you in the face that Christianity is the truth. People are hiding the truth about Christianity because they don't want to get out. They want evolution to be number one. And evolution just teaches that you are by chance alive. That out of a few, that out of a giant, uh, I'm trying to remember what evolution says. Um, we came from uh, a cell that f found out it was able to duplicate itself and as it duplicated itself I found out that it could make other things and stuff and that it, and a meteor hit a stagnant pool or lightning or whatever there's several different bases but something hit a stagnant pool of water and it started making human beings like like we evolved into monkeys or whatever and stuff but if you look at the human species, look between humans and monkeys. Monkeys should be turning into humans. Because that's what evolution states. If we came from monkeys, if we come from all these other things that evolution says we come from, we should be turning, they should be turning into humans. We should not be able to reproduce. But if you look at humanity, it is by intelligent design. Everything about humanity, everything about the world we live in is intelligent design. They say it takes millions of years for charcoal... Um, yeah, yeah, coal to be made in the ground. They have found stuff from the 1800s in coal. Ni early 1900s in the coal mines, in the coal veins. And that's what evolution teaches, and that's why these schools are getting shot up. Because evolution, they have removed God completely. God has been completely removed out of these schools. If we put God back in, allow him to be in, and make it to where it's not a offense for God to be in the schools where it's not a where it's not illegal to even say his name in a school in a public school you will have better schools less mass shootings just look at the math since 2000 alone we've had more mass shootings in America alone than our entire history up to 2000 alone from when we from including all the wars we've had 
all the mass shootings that we've had of people dying, of people getting shot, were just about equal. From 2000 alone, we've had that many mass shootings in America. And the number one group targeted is Christians. Most of the time. Usually the Christians are targeted. And it's because they teach that we are n not, by chance, we are, are by intelligent design. And the people cannot handle it because they were taught evolution. Evolution is truth. And it, it's, it's a big, huge ball that I cannot get into because I would be here for a half hour just talking about the ball and getting all up in it. And I would never get my point made. I'm trying to keep this video to about 10 minutes now. Um, but Christianity is what um, has made us, is what is, and is the reason we are what we are today. If you look at the world, Christianity is truth. Like the evidence just stacks up against atheism, stacks up against evolution. Stacks up against every religion ever. The evidence just slaps you in the face if you look at the world. But these schools are getting shot up just because kids are told they had that if they do this because evolution states that they are by chance. Okay, evolution states they are by chance. They would have zero consequences for their actions because they are, of course, by chance. And they would also, and evolution also states that um, you step on a butterfly, you may change something like f five years in the future. That's not how it works. It's not a butterfly effect. Is it just called? Um, and it's just uh, evolution just says you're by chance you're. I'm restrain myself for some reason but evolution just teaches that man is God there is no such thing as a God because man is God and man cannot do anything wrong well that's not true you look there's only one man ever on this entire planet that has walked on this planet that has never done anything wrong and he died his name is Jesus Humanity is imperfect. There has never been a perfect human on this planet except for Jesus. And he lived over 2,000 years ago on this planet. He walked this earth 2,000 years ago. During the Roman occupation. During, during the Roman Empire. Before, well, yeah, I think it was before it split up into two empires and such, such. But... But evolution just teaches that um, by chance, I, that everything I do is by chance, that nothing is ever planned out. But that's about all I got for now, guys. I'm going to repeat myself another 50 times. Um, so if you like this video, please hit the like button down below. If you didn't, hit the dislike button and tell me why in the comments down below. If you're new here, please subscribe and hit the notification button so you know when I upload great content like this. Thanks and uh, bye.